Diathermy used in surgery. What is diathermy? Diathermy is electrically induced heat or the use of high frequency electromagnetic currents as a form of physical therapy and in surgical procedures. Diathermy is also called electrosurgery. It involves the use of high frequency alternating current in surgery as either a cutting modality or used to cauterize small blood vessels. This technique induces localized tissue burning and damage. The zone of which is controlled by frequency and power of device. Diathermy is not electrocautery. Electrocautery is powered by direct current. Diathermy is powered by alternating current. The two main settings of diathermy are cutting and coagulation. Other functions are fulguration, desiccation, hemostasis, also vaporization. Types of diathermy. Diathermy in surgery is of two types monopolar diathermy bipolar diathermy first we will discuss monopolar diathermy monopolar means one active pole the other is a ground or the dispersive medium where the electricity goes to disperse the electric current oscillates between the active electrode and the dispersive electrode with the patient in between the two electrodes as you can see in the figure there is only one tool tip diathermy tool this is the cathode the active electrode the other is the plate ground plate dispersive plate that access the anode you can see in the figure this is the monopolar circuit the energy is going from the generator to the electrode from the electrode to the patient from the patient to the ground plate from the ground plate back into the generator these are the components generator active electrode which is the cathode patient dispersive or return electrode which is the anode disadvantages of monopolar circuit the ground plate should have a great surface area greater the surface area greater will be the dispersion of that energy if the surface area is decreased this results in sphere burns due to concentration of energy number 2 there may be risk of smoke and contaminant inhalation as that contaminant is burnt by the diathermy needle it vaporizes and may be inhaled by the operator number 3 implantable devices such as pacemakers and spinal cord stimulators are at risk of damage from the electrical current in diathermy as the it is passing from the needle into the patient's body and passing through the body to the ground plate number 4 implantable cardioverter defibrillator can interpret the diathermy current as unstable cardiac rhythm and potentially result in patient being shocked the second type is bipolar diathermy bipolar means two poles two active electrodes no ground electrode bipolar instruments generally are designed with two active active electrodes so current moves between the two electrodes the two electrodes are part of the instrument itself as you can see in the figure they are side by side attached to each other they look like a forceps or tweezers more precisely this type involves only that part of the tissue that lies between the tips of two electrodes because energy goes from generator to one electrode through that tissue and then to the other electrode and back onto the generator so it can be used in patient with implantable devices like pacemakers because current will not pass through the body and will not interfere with pacemakers they are also used in microsurgery because they can target very small tissues that can fit in between those tweezers thank you